I'm Hannah Dale and I'm the founder and creative director of Rendell Designs. We're based here in Lincolnshire and this is where I take a lot of the inspiration for my illustrations of animals and wildlife. I studied zoology at university and part of that was animal behaviour and I spent a lot of time doing field work. So to pass some of the hours of just sitting there taking observations out in the countryside, um, I'd often take a sketchbook with me. That experience of just quickly drawing and sketching animals in the field, in the wild, uh, from life, I think was an amazing training ground for eventually going on to having a career painting and illustrating wildlife. When I started Rendell Designs, it was just a total dream come true to be able to combine the passion for wildlife and animals with um, the lifelong love of art and creating that I'd always enjoyed. Whenever we develop a new product, we put a lot of thought into trying to make it really different and unique. And whether that's in the materials that we use or the extra added details and um, little special touches, we really try to make it something that people would love and just be really different and something really unique and special. One of the first product ranges that we ever did was greeting cards. So we sourced some board, it's milled in the Lake District and um, it comes from sustainable sources, but it's uncoated and it has a textured surface on it, which it looks a lot like watercolour. And because of my illustrations are all based in watercolour, um, it meant that it almost looks like the illustration has been painted directly onto the card. And it was important to me that the cards then had this kind of um, textural, tactile quality. Um, and I think we managed to achieve that with the card that we picked. So that's the kind of detail and um, attention that we put into every single product that we develop. We started working with Royal Worcester quite early on in the life of Rendell Designs. They originally approached us to sign a licensing deal for six mugs, six Royal Worcester mugs, and I remember when they first launched them, I think it was back in 2013, we went to go and have a look at our products on their stand. We went onto this amazing, huge stand with all the different licenses and brands that uh, Port Merion carry. Uh, just there on the corner of a shelf, a tiny little space were our six mugs and we were so excited and so proud. And ever since then, and because of the success of those six mugs, uh, the, the range has expanded and it, we now uh, produce dinnerware, all sorts of giftware, Te textiles, um, tableware, as they've recently done a glassware range. It's just gone from strength to strength, really. And we're so proud to work with a company like Port Merion and with the iconic Royal Worcester brand. It's a really collaborative relationship. We have a lot of input into the design and the style of every single item that they produce. Our relationship with our retailers is really important to us and we're really lucky to work with hundreds of amazing independent shops across the country and across the world. It's always such a pleasure to go and visit one of our stockists and talk to the owner or the buyer and just understand how much care and love and dedication goes into curating the collections of giftware and we just feel so proud and privileged to be a part of that. And it's especially nice when we're able to go and visit a shop and see how our products have been displayed. I don't think I'll ever get over the thrill of going walking past a shop window and seeing my illustrations in there. It's just unbelievably exciting. We were incredibly lucky to win a Queen's Award for Enterprise last year and we had the amazing privilege of a drinks reception at Buckingham Palace hosted by Prince Charles to celebrate getting the award. So that was really exciting and just something that we never imagined would be possible eight years ago when we started the business. A new collaboration
collaboration that we've been really excited about has been with Wax Lyrical and we recently launched a home fragrance range with them. It was really important to me that the illustrations had a strong connection with the actual fragrance itself and it took us quite a while to work out how to do that, how to con how to create a kind of natural link between the artwork and the fragrance and the way that we did it was we ended up creating three different collections so one is based on meadow one is based on hedgerow and one is based on woodland and we've taken um, inspiration from all of those environments for both the fragrances and for the artwork and um, so it creates a really nice link between the actual look and design of the product and the fragrance itself the other thing that's really nice about the collection is that the candles and the diffusers are all in beautiful ceramic vessels. So once you've used the candle and enjoyed the fragrance of it, you've still got something that you can then use as a trinket pot or, you know, something around the home. And I think that sense of not having disposable packaging is something that really ties into our ethos as a company as well. And I think having something beautiful to keep once you've enjoyed the candle, um, I think makes the range really special. We've always got a full pipeline of new things coming through, uh, which is really exciting and lots of exciting things on the horizon for 2021, so we can't wait to show them to you.